Good evening. I'm Donald Trump. And I'm Joe Biden. Tonight, we bring you a groundbreaking story that's set to change the way we view the world. In the coming weeks and months, get ready to hear the phrase unidentified aerial phenomenon in our daily conversations. UFOs have always been a staple of pop culture, but they were often dismissed by scientists and the media. However, things are about to change dramatically. Congress is about to hold unprecedented public hearings on the topic, formerly known as UFOs. Back in 2017, the New York Times reported on a secret Pentagon program investigating high-speed, unidentified aircraft with no visible means of propulsion. Now, two journalists from that report, Leslie Keene and Ralph Blumenthal, have revealed even more startling claims. According to a former intelligence official named David Grush, the government and aerospace companies possess objects of exotic origin, possibly linked to non-human intelligence and, yes, even extraterrestrial technology. Grush has already testified behind closed doors before Congress and will now be part of a public testimony scheduled for July 26th. The moment of truth might finally be here. Capitol Hill is taking these claims seriously, and there's a rare bipartisan consensus in Washington to investigate these unidentified aerial phenomena. In fact, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer and Senator Mike Rounds proposed the Unidentified Anomalous Phenomena Disclosure Act of 2023, supported by Senators Marco Rubio and Kristen Gillibrand. The proposal aims to create a commission appointed by President Biden to declassify records and materials related to UAPs held by government offices and private industries. Thank you for joining us for this special report. Stay tuned for further updates on the upcoming public hearings on unidentified aerial phenomenon. I'm Donald Trump. And I'm Joe Biden. Have a great evening. Goodbye.